another lick of the day i'm brett papa and today i got a request somebody's like can you put you know positions two and three together so that's what we're gonna do here today for your eyes only <laughs> positions two and three but we're gonna change up the key we're gonna do f sharp minor because why not all right so I didn't start doing this lick till a little while ago, and it's out of position three. So position three would be. So it's seven, nine, seven, nine, seven, nine, eight, nine, and then seven, ten, seven, nine. Okay? So this part goes. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go six, nine, right? So. And then jump down to B7, back to 9 on the G. Now we're going to go to 10, B, 9, and then... Alright, so that whole part. Okay, so now, a little outside of the scale, but that's all right with this one note. Okay, so what we're gonna do is go seven, 10, and then you go down to seven and go. Okay, so that's seven, eight. The scale would be seven, nine, but we're gonna do a little blues note action here. And then 10, seven. Okay, so you got. Okay, so that last part is. And then back to the B. G, B, G, B. All right, strings that is, right? Not frets. So you got. So that's all been in third position. Right? Now I'm going to switch up to fourth position, which is right where this F sharp minor chord is, right? So we got. So. And then I'm going to go up quick. So we slide in from nine to 11. And then I'm going to go down to the B string. All right, so, so it's, and then, all right, and then I go, so what I do there is I bend up on B12, catch, keep that bent, catch E, 12 fret, and then, all right, now I'm going to go, all right, so that's kind of a little bend on 12, 10, 12, and then, and then, and then this, I'm just basically outlining the chord. So we got one more time. So you're really playing off of that chord tone, right? Of, of the F sharp minor. So. And then. So that's going to be. 
and then I slide back from four into three. Right? So it's just 11, nine, but a quick. And then pull off to seven. And then do it again. So yeah, the whole thing. mess around with each position and try to find some new ways of playing it like I get my own ruts and I play the same licks over and over and it's not until I you know come up with courses and, and teach stuff that's down at brettpapa.com if you want to check it out but it's not until I do that and actually think like okay I got to come up with a hundred different ideas for this product <laughs> I can't play the same thing over and over and over again so how can I play this particular scale in a new way or how can I combine these two scales together in a new way so I'm not just playing the same old licks every day myself. Can I add chromatic passing tones in there, blues notes, what can I do to mix up this same scale I've been playing for God knows how long now to make it new and exciting for myself, right? And then, you know, it's just sometimes it's just one little tweak and then it opens up a whole new door. So make sure you're going into the positions, not how you normally do. If you transition every single time in the exact same way, change it up a little bit. You know, go in on a lower string or or change it up somehow so that you're accessing new ideas and new intervals. And that can make your own playing a lot more exciting so if you like what you see by all means please share the videos that would be awesome like i said before down at brettpapa.com there is tons of stuff to help you in your soloing career <laughs> whether you want to jam on the couch or on the stage tons of stuff they go over not only how to play licks but how to put them to music where it counts and then there's going to be a subscribe button over here Make sure you click the bell. If you click the subscribe button, that'll let you be notified when new videos come out. I post up to three and sometimes more videos a week. So check that out as well. There's tons of stuff, links, song requests, free soloing series down below. So check that out. And then I'll put some playlists over here. We've got some song tutorials and how to solo better videos over here too. So check that out as well. Thank you so much for watching and the continued support. We'll catch you next time.